What's going on guys? We have this I am potato guy. He was about to leave the game. I just found it quite funny that I didn't join this game from the start and there was a guy called I am potato in here and he gets replaced by me. I just found that quite entertaining that's finding me. Will find me eventually. Maybe. There I am. Right, I already have one kill. Take in account that we are 11 kills behind as I join. No, 11, 21 kills, 22 kills behind. So, I do lose this game. This is the only game of this series I will probably upload in that I actually lost. But, I had to upload it because of how close it actually came. It came right down to it, to be honest. Although, we should, probably should have won it. You know, but stuff happens anyway. Onto the SWAT. I really actually like this gun a fair bit. It's the best gun I've used so far and um that I've uploaded anyway. Best gun so far. Made in Switzerland, made by Swiss Arms. Has an eight hundred RPM which is quite fast knowing it's a free round burst. Damage is medium, range is medium, recoil is low to medium. Thirty rounds standard, forty five minute extended mag. I'm starting to believe that most of these assault rifles all have the same stats according to the Call of Duty website. But, you know, whatever. Personally, I think this gun's good, but its main downfall is the... F well, it's not even its own fault. Its main downfall is the fact that the M8 A1 is just a lot better than this. So there would be no need to actually use this. Unless you're doing some crazy challenge like I am. Otherwise, there's no point. You might as well use the M8. It's an all-round better gun. You're going to get more kills with it. You're going to do better with it. It's as simple as that. But some people, you know, they prefer our gun handles and all that. I like how this gun handles. It looks nice. I think it looks slightly like the ACR from Modern Warfare 3, which I really liked. And I've also been told this thing with full auto, full auto on is pretty much the ACR, but... I find that hard to believe, knowing how knowing how good the ACR was. I was really panicking here, like until the teammate came and killed. I was like, I don't want to die. No. Anyway, still like 20 kills behind. So it's just it's just that it's just that panicking stage between getting the VSAT and then getting dogs, and then the panic keeps even more between dogs and swarm. Although normally if I sit there with dogs and just play it a little bit defensive. The dogs will normally go and get me the swarm, but not always. You just gotta hope for the best, really, on that one. Like, luckily I um, didn't get killed off and then get the one burst headshot on that guy, so that cleaned that guy up. And he, luckily I found that guy, so I got two nice easy kills to me my dogs and swarm, to be honest. And this. I don't even know what killed that, whether it was me or my swarm. It's just like, boom. Anyway, give this gun, I'll give this gun a 6 out of 10 rating. That's because I like burst weapons. They're a lot easier to hit people with over range. They can fall down a little bit short range, they're really medium to long range weapons, but that's most. it depends how I play in the game. I can easily handle the gun so I'm in a medium to long range gunfight. So yeah. Um it also looks nice, it handles nice. I think I would have preferred it a lot more with stock on but I didn't even get to that point with it because I was able to get a decent gameplay before that point even happened. The clip size is a bit smaller I think the clip size is smaller than the M eight which is a bit of a letdown, but this gun still gets 6 out of 10 for sure. The I ran out of ammo in it, as you can see there. I really should use scavenger in these videos. Otherwise, I end up running around with a random gun. I should have killed this guy. But, yeah, well, would have given me another VSAT. And if you see, my team are pretty much caught. We did actually catch up at one point, but there's only so much you can do with a crappy team. And I was not able to come back and win this. So, the line for this is... Good gun, but the M8 is just better. So, yeah, go use the M8, I'd say, honestly. 32 and 2 in this video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.